hello, hello, and welcome back to CK3. We're doing pretty well over here. We're pretty, pretty big. We are 57, and we don't have any more sons to give land to, which is pretty, pretty lovely. We dealt with that issue. We're still going to lose two kingdoms upon succession. We will have claims on them, so it's not going to be a problem to take it back. Now, I could easily go to a war now for guys like this or this, you know, or even this whole guy. I could take more and more land. The issue is I wouldn't have anyone to give it to and if I don't find someone to give it to I would lose that upon succession as well. It could create some issues. So I think right now we are just gonna wait to die honestly <laughs> and we're gonna hope we don't die in the next 14 years. You know I need my heir, my genius Herculean heir to grow up because there's gonna be so many factions against me if I'm a child ruler. I mean, come on, we wouldn't want that. Also, why is there so many factions against me? How dare you? Okay, none of them are concerning. Even those guys, I don't really care. There is also a problem with this little duchy over here. The guy who holds those counties might inherit land in this kingdom. He's a primary heir of this guy. So let's just go ahead and revoke his title. I mean, I can't have that happening. I need this land, thank you very much, just so. And now I can finally give this land to, I guess, this guy. I mean, I have no one else to give it to, so I will just grant you this title. You're welcome, you hold a whole freaking duchy now, whoever you are. <laughs> and that's Delta, so let's sway this guy instead. We were swaying the other one, so he would give us the county back. This is part of our main duchy. I really, really want this back, my dude. Give it back. Look, it's making so much money. I want it. I want it. We're doing pretty well on money, to be fair. I mean, we have our counties making us money. I am building whenever I can you know i'm building first quarry over here to make more and more money everything is going lovely so far so let's just take it peacefully you know i don't want to die in battle when my heir is two years old so i'm not gonna do much i'm just gonna chill about make sure i'm building and making money and stuff like that no more wars for me unless someone declares war on me you know or i have another son which is actually possible one of my wife, yeah, this wife, is 36. She could still have more children. If she does, well, then we will quickly go for a war for Dachi. Until then, no point. No point going for a war for any freaking land. I'm just gonna chill. And maybe hold this court. Why not? Why not? Okay. Hoo hoo hoo. I gain a mysterious book. Or I possibly... No, no that's not me. Someone else possibly gains learning. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, I will take the mysterious book. Thank you very much. <gasps> what is this? A feast under my name. They want to throw a feast for me and they're going to pay me for it. Ooh la la. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take 200 gold. Yeah, he has a hook on me. But do I care? He holds a barony. I do not care. And what do we have here? Uh-huh. 100% weapon balanced cities, yeah? You be rivals, I don't care. Nice, 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 we got gold out of those. This is lovely, let me just straight away uh, upgrade this. That would be lovely. Here, yeah, I will upgrade this and now I'm out of gold, damn it. <laughs> well, gold well spent, I would say, gold well spent. Oh, my wife died, 72, how sad is that? Okay, I don't have enough wives. So let's have another one. Let's make sure she's... Yeah, I have it set already on infertile. And let's find ourselves the oldest one possible. <laughs> you? Would you like to be my wife? Thank you very much. Thank you. I just need to have enough wives, you know. What will you give me? Book inspiration. Her skill is merely decent. Well, if it's decent, then I don't care. Do I? Get it away from me. Ooh, we have an inspiration and she wants to forge me a crown and her skill is legendary. Okay, I want a crown. Yes, I do. I'm left with one gold, but I will get a crown out of this. So, it's great. Oh no, my sick mare. Oh, my strong war horse. No. Okay, to be fair, I'm 63. I'm about to die. It's only right that my horse dies with me, isn't it? I, f I think so. I think so. Our air is 7 at the moment, which is really, really nice. I mean, 
Do we want him to be temperate? Yes, we do, don't we? Yeah, we definitely do. He's turning out really, really well. I mean, come on. He's bossy, you know. He's good. He's really, really good. And he's only 7 and he already has 12 prowess, which is like amazing. Okay, amazing. Who else wants to sponsor me something? Adventure? Um, I know he's legendary as well, but... Hmm... 176... Do we want something? What are we missing? What are we missing? We need something on a pedestal and we need small wall ornaments and a book and a furniture. We could sponsor him, try to get one of those. I mean, why not? Why not? Let, let's do that. Let's spend our gold wisely. So, where does he wants to go? Uh, <laughs> does it matter? No, I don't think it matters. Let's just... The world is yours, my friend. You just go whenever you want to go. And I'll just... Excuse me, what is this? Isn't that part of my main... Yeah, what happened there? Huh? Okay, uh, truly unique... Or <laughs> something truly unique. Let's try that. I mean, what? What is this? What, why does this exist? No, no, my dude. No. Oh, I need an antiquarian. Wait, wait. I need an antiquarian. There you go. And now, wait, dude. This this cannot be. This cannot be. This is mine. I don't know if you heard, but this land. Is mine? How does he just take it? This is ridiculous, I tell you. Ridiculous. Oh no, my wife died. Oh no. Can we take him on with 900? I think we can. I think this is easy for our troops. Easy freaking peasy. Uh, <laughs> I will take the prestige. Thank you. And we are swaying some dude. Oh yeah, we're swaying this guy that holds our county. Now it's on 75%. I'm kinda scared he's not gonna give it to me. Let's maybe try to find a hook on him. Let's try that. I really want that county back. If we don't find a hook on him, then we will just, you know, take it, provoke it. If he goes to war with us, we'll just take it on, you know. Nothing else we can do. Ooh, illustrious crown! Look at that prestige. Men and arms, main, men and arms maintenance minus seven percent. That's really freaking good. Oh wow, I'm loving this. Look at that illustrious crown. That's the first time I'm seeing this. And considering all of our other artifacts are merely, you know, decent. <laughs> Except this one. This one's masterwork. But the rest is uh, shyster. So I'm very happy that this crown is such a good quality. It's really freaking lovely, isn't it? And now, let's see. 66% is higher quality. <laughs> okay. Make them pay. He's wounded. But might be of slightly higher quality. Okay, that's fine then. Can we just take it back? Thank you. And no, my co not the gardener. I need the gardener. Where's my physician, by the way? I need a physician and I need a gardener. Come on, gardener. Development, growth and rent capital. I mean, I need a gardener. Thank you very much. And now, 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 let's see. So who land is this that we just took? It's part of this duchy. Who holds this duchy? Uh, shiny mail for 335 no that's too expensive wait you hold this duchy then who holds this duchy you hold both duchies what how dare you okay it seems that yes you do you own all the land in it as well uh, well that's that's not great but i'm gonna grant it to you because it is part of your main duchy second main duchy apparently so you know eh, don't care if she's an artist and i'll come off it honestly oh another one of my wives died no how sad is that? Who are you? My daughter. 
I'll educate you myself. <laughs> and too few spouses. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, my vassal is a criminal. He only owes barony, so I don't... No, are you joking? Now that I'm 64, you're pregnant. What if it's a son? What if it's a son and I don't have a land to give it to? Damn you, woman. This is so freaking annoying. Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do is get ourselves some infertile wives. Uh, like this. <laughs> does it matter? This, 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 this doesn't matter, does it? Let's get the oldest one possible. This one. Yes. And what's happening with the artifact? 85% it will be higher quality. Well, then I take that. Okay, gained progress. Nice, nice, nice. Now let's hold that card then. And what do you get to say? Oh no. Ah, goodness me. Let's get the gain defended soldiers behavior because if we don't we have to spend gold or get punished troublemakers which is night effectiveness plus 10% we might go for a war for dachi yet again if we have a son so let's not take that now this one I really don't care and I lose gold or extra taxes uh, right it's not worth it it's honestly not worth it Right, okay, okay, we have 300 gold, we did swap to stewardship uh, to get some buildings going, you know, so we're making very, very decent gold at the moment. Uh, I didn't think we will have to fight again, so I was like, oh, why are we in Marshall, we're not gonna fight, you know. But now that I might have another son, uh, I am scared, I am very, very scared. This is not my heir, by the way, I thought it's my heir and I was happy he got out a good trade, he is not my heir. He just looks a lot like my heir. Come on, they look the same. I thought they were the same person. Okay, so I don't care. And he is already nine. Really, really nice. I want to find him a good wife. The problem is most of them are of my dynasty. So I'm very, very scared of the inbred trade. I am. Because what if my heir is inbred? So I would love to marry him to like an Amazonian genius and stuff like this to make sure the Herculean and genius preserves, you know, that would be freaking lovely, wouldn't it? But also, also, right, hear me out. If we marry him to someone beautiful and they do manage to have a child that's a genius, Herculean and beautiful, we would be able to strengthen blown line. And I mean, that's like the best thing ever, isn't it? So do I try to go for someone that has similar traits and they can like prevail and make sure that their children are genius and Herculean? Or do we just go for someone beautiful to try and get all three traits going? I mean, there is not many choices of people of not our dynasty. Most of the people who do have, you know, hail, who do have the robust most of them are from our dynasty. I mean, the ones that have more than one. Yeah, my granddaughter, quick and robust. There is another one, Amazonian, intelligent, Amazonian, quick. Both my dynasty, both my granddaughters and stuff like that. So even if I'd want them, it would be tricky because they could be inbred. So do I risk the inbred trait to get the Amazonian ones? Or do I just go for beautiful? And I actually do think I do just go for beautiful. I, I think so. I think let's go for beautiful, but go by prestige gain. So he doesn't lose prestige by marrying down. So let's find someone beautiful. Harry is a four-year-old beautiful. Oh my god. I really want to marry him to her, but my dynasty. My dynasty. I don't think I can. Okay, let's go for this four-year-old then. He gets prestige and she is beautiful, so that could be our next heir. I mean, that's just too good to pass on. I'm just gonna do that then. She is slightly younger, five years younger, which is completely freaking fine. Uh, the longer they take to make children, the better for me because there's gonna be less of the freaking children, isn't there? And then there is not that much problems with the succession. Oh, thank God it's a daughter. Gee, I was so freaking scared. Okay, we have a daughter. That's perfectly freaking fine, isn't it? And she's 43. She still could have children, but hopefully not. Hopefully not.
No. No, why are you wounded? No. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I hope he's gonna be okay because this sucks very, very, very much. He's my heir and I need him to be okay. I okay? The dangerous faction, it's just peasants. Um, I really want to revoke this title. There was no secrets there. So I'm still on 75%. It could fail. Other people will join him. If I do declare the war, I mean, if he does declare a war, the peasant faction is gonna be going against me. <gasps> Yes, yes, okay, 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 this is more important, this is way more important, we can go for the partition, so we're not gonna lose one of the kingdoms if we do that. On the other hand, if he does create the kingdom, we're gonna have three kingdom titles, which will be enough to make an empire. So should we do it now, or should we do it after we die? I think we should still do it now and just create the kingdom ourselves to make sure we don't lose that land, you know, to another kingdom. Yeah, I think we have to pass it. We've been waiting for this forever. We've been waiting to get the partition forever. Okay, I'm changing it. Thank you very much. We are on partition. So under succession, now we lose only one kingdom because the title already exists. So we are going to lose it, but it's just going to be this bit. And it's going to be perfectly fine. I mean, this guy holding this entire duchy is going to have the duchy and the kingdom over here. He's not going to be as strong as us. So there is no way we have to worry about that. So let's just be happy. We've got the partition. That's what we've been waiting for. We've been only going into the hereditary rule to try to get it. What are we now? Now let's change this to battlements. Uh, doesn't really matter. There's nothing we really desperately need as much as we needed the hereditary rule because upon succession we would lose this whole kingdom again and we would have to go to two wars, wasting time that we could use to take all of those little kingdoms over here. So thankfully we don't have to go to that war once we die. Lovely. So the guy we send on adventure wants to come back home and we get uh, fingernails out of it. Uh, yeah, okay, Let, let's just take the fingernails. Show me my fingernails. Where are they? Are they in the court? Are there something I can put around? What are the fingernails? Fingernails. Oh, it's rubbish. Oh, should have never let him come back. Okay, I thought it could be something better, you know? It's fingernails of Saint Margaret, but apparently it's only Plowers Press 1. Uh, very disappointed. I spent 200 gold on this. <laughs> But what can I do? I'm just gonna have to live with it. This freaking faction, if they could just freaking declare war on me, that would be freaking lovely. Um, right. Another one. Right. Right. I don't think so. One already disappointed me. So, you know. Can they declare this war on me, by the way? I just want this one to war to be declared on me so I can declare the title of this guy and go to war with him if I have to. But I think I might risk it and do it now. Uh, why? Is, I'm I'm so sad about this. I hope he's okay. I really hope he's okay. I don't know. Shouldn't we revoke it? The thing is, if we do revoke it, yeah, we will be over the domain limit. So really, what's the point? I know I've been so on it, trying to get my entire duchy back. But honestly, if I hold it all, then I'm going to have too much land and is that really what i want no and also fucking finally okay okay uh peasants you have to serve your lord thank you very much and i will fight you there you go where you are is that all of them oh that's all of them oh that's no worry whatsoever okay then there you go thank you very much thank you thank you thank you Oh, okay, so he came back with another item. Okay, that's much better, isn't it? Okay, I thought he was just coming back with his uh, fingernails. But no, he brought me a illustrious pedestal item that gives me prestige, monthly renown and coastal advantage. Okay, don't care about the coastal advantage, but the rest is very, very nice. Now, we already have four artifacts over here. So where do we display it? Let's see. What is this? Prestige 0 0.25 a month. Mm, okay, so I guess the fingernails. We don't need the fingernails. The rest is good. This one gives us piety, domain taxes. This one gives us prestige, dread gain. Prestige, this one's not great, you know, but 
Fingernails, we don't need those. So let's put that beautiful Elastia sword on them and look at that. Beautiful. Looks a bit rusty, but you know, it's an artifact, so it's all good. Okay, it seems like my heir is no longer wounded. Really, really nice. He's 11. Damn, I really could take more land. I need 10 more counties to find a new empire, and I already have three kingdoms. I mean, I have two kingdoms and third one ready to be constructed. So I could try to go for 10 more counties, but honestly, uh, it wouldn't be so easy, would it? Uh, I could attack this guy, and then I would have to go to war with this guy, and that's like two, three duchies to give away. And no one to give it to. So I guess we're going to have to wait and hope our son and heir can do that. I know it's a bit of a worst because I do have 2000 prestige, 600 piety. I don't have the gold, okay? I don't have the gold, but the gold will come. So, you know, we will get there. We get there. Even if we go, to, yeah, exactly. Even if we go to those wars and we get the land required, there's no way during those wars we're going to get enough gold to found an empire so we're just gonna wait we just gotta wait till we die because honestly not much we can do not much we can do we just have to do it with the next guy no okay i mean yeah but no <laughs> okay we died at 69 nice okay of old age makes sense now we are 13 well this is a bit of an issue isn't it um right right we are fair Oh my goodness, this is ah, honestly an issue. Honestly, I do not like this, but what can I do? What can I do? Not much. Not much indeed. Okay, let's just make sure we have good people on. And what do we have here? Fertility? No, we don't care about the fertility. Okay, so there's nothing new, huh? Okay, don't care then. And all our artifacts are still where they're supposed to be. Fine by me. Okay. Um. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's unpause and see how much of trouble we are in. Already a faction created against me. Oh wow! 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 Uh. Right. Right. So all of those. I mean, this one's not a peasant faction, but honestly, he's not gonna do anything about it. This is peasants. This is peasants, and this one is very, very concerning. So. This is my vassal and he wants it, right. See, the li little issue I'm having is that I don't have any sons or daughters to marry off to his children to try to get an alliance with him. So it is a bit concerning. Uh, I don't know. I also cannot marry off anyone, you know, except, well, myself, but they don't even have anyone and no one else will give me alliance. It's not my brother, sister, it's just cousins and cousins don't matter for the alliance. So I am in a bit of a pickle, I'll tell you, you know, do you have like someone? No, you only have those sons, damn you, and a daughter that's lisping. Well, I'm not marrying your lisping daughter, I tell you that much. And do you have, ooh, ooh. I could marry her, but it seems like he's not going to give her away. Damn, that is really, really concerning. Uh, right. Right. Oh, goodness me. Okay. This is very, very troubling. I mean, like, very, very troubling. And I can't even host a feast to, like, make them like me more because, well, I'm a child, so I can't do that. Oh, God. This is very bad. <laughs> And now someone's calling me to war? Who are you? Who, who are you? Why do we... Uh, why do we have an alliance? Who did I marry? Your daughter? Is that the one I'm referred to? Yeah, okay. Well, I accept, but I'm not coming over to help. Damn, this is... <laughs> I'm gonna be on my own war over here very, very soon. Um, right, three months. Is all we have, is it? Damn you. Okay, 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 it's falling down. Okay, I've put this guy on my council. He was uh, in the faction. I put him in a council because he has 43 learning. So I decided to just put him in there. And now it seems it's finally falling down. I was very, very scared about that. Considering, oh no, oh no. There's also this going on. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. I see. Wow, wow, wow. Ha, ha, ha. What if I grant her pardon? 
she gains opinion out of me, but he doesn't gain opinion on me. Wow, okay. Uh, okay, this is falling down, so this is good. This is not an issue. This is an issue now. This really is an issue now. Why you hate me so much, everyone? Honestly. What if I grant you pardon? We'll be happy with me then. I know I could try to imprison him. Uh, it wouldn't work. It was on 0%. So what if I grant you pardon? You like me now? You're happy enough to leave this faction? No? Uh, I just need to get them to like me more. Damn it. What if I try to put this guy on the council? But everyone on the council is already a powerful vassal. So there is not much I can do, my dude. And what is this? What is this? Who are you? What do you want? You want this county? Gee, okay. So now I have to fight this guy. But why I'm gonna fight this guy, those guys are gonna declare war on me, won't they? They definitely will. They're already over. I mean, I'm gonna be weak now. They're gonna declare war on me. Um, Right, if we lose that, it's just for lower crime authority. We're just gonna decrease it, raise it on later. Uh, not so problematic as a war for the entire title. So I'm just gonna deal with this. Uh, they're all the way over there? Or is that people in the other war? Who am I in war with? Wait, this is my war. I'm just in a war with this guy. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Let me raise all troops then. Oh, this is gonna be expensive, isn't it? Okay, let me go here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's try to win this quickly, uh, which might not be possible because enemy allies are joining war. Uh, right. Right. Let's just try to take a county off of him. He's coming my way. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Oh. Okay, so do we change or do we go to war? I think we accept. I think we have to accept because if we go to war with those guys, although we could probably win, we would be at two wars. It would go on forever and I would lose all the freaking gold I have. So I'm going to say I have no choice and I'm just going to go with it. Uh, there is no much choice. And as soon as I can, I will just change it back. Once they like me, I will be able to change it back right now. Uh, let's. Is this the best I can do? Honestly? Honestly? Are you joking me? Damn you. Okay, uh, let's attack him then and try to win this by fighting. I mean, let's just try. No, are you joking me? Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, in that case, let's call on house members. Two thousand. Where are you? Uh, and where are you? Okay, let's try to call on this guy. To this war. Okay. Come and help. Because this is honestly. Troubling. Troubling in it. Okay. Let's just try to run away. I want to lose this county. I really don't. I like my county. What? What? Who wants to become independent? No. They don't want to become independent. They want the entire empire. Which faction is that? Oh no. Oh no. <sighs> well, I cannot be threatened in this one. Right. Right. This is what I fear that I'm gonna become a king at the age 14, and this is gonna happen, and this is what I feared, and this is ridiculous. Okay, okay. Let's surrender the war for the county. That's fine. And let's go to war with all the other guys for the kingdom. And let's try to catch him over here then. I need to fight them before they get all together. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Go here. Go here, go here, go here. No, 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 we have to catch them. We do have to catch them. Or this is very, very lost. Uh, damn. I mean, we are honestly screwed if we don't catch him. 
we honestly are. I mean, I'm calling house members to war, but I honestly really need to freaking win this. And there's another faction. They're gonna send an ultimatum very, very soon. Damn you. Okay, we won this. <sighs> we won one battle. Okay, let's... What do we do then? Do we just try to take the capital? What are they doing? They're taking my land. I do have some allies, but... <sighs> Damn it, I cannot join you. I'm on my own freaking war, can I now? Gee, okay. You're, I'm not befrogged because you broke an alliance. Right. Right, I forgot that. Right. Right. Then I will just marry someone else who's beautiful. How old am I? 15. Okay. Uh. Yeah, right. You'll do. You'll do. Whatever. Just marry me. And let's try to take this. Damn it. This is... Really... Okay, I'm, I'm of age. I'm of age. This is nice. This is nice. Uh, yes, Marshall. For show. Sure, for show. Sure. And now let's try to take this. Damn, 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 damn. Okay, this is taken. So, will you white piece? No, damn it. Uh, right. Right. Uh, let's then... Okay, my allies are here and they're fighting. I did call the guy I'm gonna take the kingdom of as an ally <laughs> to help me fight. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm a bit rude like that. Okay, and then let's try to go back then. And let's try to take as much land as we can. Damn it. Okay, okay. And let's try to take this capital. Is he coming back? No, he's not. I will never be able to catch him. Then he's taking my land, but this is fine. Let's just take this. Let's take this. No worries about it. And will he accept white piece? Yes, he will. Okay, white piece. White piece. White piece the shit out of this. Be between this, Before the 6,000 stack comes at me. Thank you. Damn, okay. Whew. Okay, and now there is another one like this. But he's going down. This is going down. This went away. Okay, we are safe. We are of age now as well. So this is all no problem whatsoever. Um, right, let's disband this. I don't need to be losing this much gold. Oh, this was troublesome. Troublesome indeed. Okay. I will ransom those prisoners in that case. Do you own any from more than a county? Uh, no, none of you do. Right. Okay. And now I can imprison those guys, but they're not gonna agree. They will just rebel. I'm not gonna do that. If I want the war, I would just take them, right? But I didn't want the war. And I did not want to win the war. I would not be able to go on forever trying to win that war. He did have approximately the same amount of troops as me. It would be a bit tricky. So I'm just gonna let them have the land. Especially that they are my dynasty. And I will just have to take this back. The issue is he is very very strong, isn't he? Where are my troops raised? Excuse me? Ah, oh, okay. Whatever. Uh, you go away. Right, and how many troops in total does he have? 10,000? Damn, I do have claims, but I don't have that many troops. Okay, we'll have to see what we do with that. Uh, we definitely have to take it back at some point. <laughs> we are fortunately 17. Uh, we are gluttonous. This is not great, but we are also vengeful and brave. We are tough soldier and aggressive attacker. So we should be fine, I think, I hope. So let's not worry. Next time we will try to take it back somehow. Maybe try to ally ourselves to the Abbasids. That would be the way to go. Uh, until then, okay, we are a new guy. We are genius and Herculean. We are a bit smaller than we were. We will take it back. No worries. We are making decent gold. We did manage to white peace all this, this rebellion. Now we're of age. Now not everyone's gonna hate us incredibly. So this is not so bad, not so bad whatsoever. For now, Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!